What's up guys, Ruxin34 back with another epic video and today we have a Christmas mystery box. So this box is not necessarily like Christmas themed, but it is for Christmas. So me and Rhyme Style both sent each other a mystery box of stuff just that we wanted to send each other, kind of as like a Christmas swap kind of thing. And I'm going to be opening up this box and later he's going to open up the box I sent him. Who knows when it'll get there, USPS is crazy right now, but he will have a video on his channel in like a few days probably opening one of these for me so let's see what he sent us before we do that the giveaway i'll be giving away ghost reaper and winter cherries obelisk the tormentor dark eradicator War warlock and secret rare blue eyes white dragon all you got to do is like this video be subscribed and let me know your favorite item that rhyme style sent us and let's hop into it i'm really excited i want to see what he sent us here we go let's see oh my goodness all right let's just go ahead and do this let's just pull all this stuff out so we have that that looks like it might be a graded card oh my goodness I hope he didn't send this too much. I'm going to feel like I uh, I failed. He didn't send good enough stuff. I think mine's pretty cool, though. You guys are going to want to see what I sent him. Ooh. All right, so we got some uh, mystery stuff. He made it very mysterious. Put it in the white packaging, which is really good. Oh, look. We have a 2020 tin. That's pretty cool. And a ooh, legendary collection, too. That's cool. And let's see what else. Should we open those first, or should we go through the... Okay, this says careful opening. I feel like, okay, I have a guess what that is. So let's go ahead and let's do these and we'll do the openings. How about that? All right, so we have this and we're gonna just rip into this the best we can. What do? What is my guess for this? This feels like uh, one of those Japanese things that we open, the maximum gold thing. That's what this feels like. That's not, but it, this is some sort of Japanese product. Oh, oh, what is this? The red one? Is this the one with the ghost rares? Rarity collection. Oh, okay. Okay, that's pretty insane. Time out. This is actually like extremely cool. Isn't this where the blue eyes comes from? Potentially? Ghost rare? Yeah, that's really, really cool. So we're probably not going to open all the products in this video. Um, this one might be its own video, which would be pretty cool. So we might save that one for its own video. So epic. That's a good start, Rhyme. That's a good start. I, I respect that. Okay. So these look like, these feel like PSA cards. So I feel like those got to wait. Ooh, what is this? This is like, oh, this is awesome. This is literally like opening presents. All right. I um, don't want to shake anything too much, but definitely some sort of box. But this is an unusual shape, so I'm not sure what this is. I'm guessing Japanese again, just because I don't recognize the shape. Or, um, I can't remember. I can't remember anything like this. Hey, Japanese, it looks like. Or that could be Korean. Yeah, this is Korean. Oh, LOB. Korean LOB. Yes. Very good. Korean Legend of Blue Eyes, the 40-pack boxes. This is classic. All right, so we have all kinds of stuff right here to open. He has sent us all kinds of content right now. This, I'm guessing, is a deck. That feels like some sort of like starter deck or something because it, it just feels like it. This almost looks like a window right there. But see like this right here? Yeah, that, I'm guessing that that is a starter deck. Should we open one of these? Yeah, let's see what these PSA cards are. I mean, what in the world could he have put it up? This seems like a PSA card. What in the world kind of PSA card could he have sent us? Oh, gosh. 2000 and what? 2008? Oh! Jim Min! Oh, my goodness. He sent us a retro pack. PSA 10. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. This card is really, really cool. Yeah, Blue Eyes Ultimate kind of got the shaft because it didn't really get a printing until like the shonen jump in like 2006 i think maybe 2007 and this is 2008 so like this was like its second printing ever so they didn't really respect it too much this is incredible this is really cool yeah this is really really awesome yeah i don't i don't even know what the value is it, it's pretty cheap as a common card but as i said it's just it got the shaft and this is like one of the coolest printings this is a secret rare that is really cool and it makes sense because we opened retro pack we both did it we both pulled one of these i submitted one but it's still gone so that's really cool that's my favorite thing yet probably probably than that let's see what this starter deck is i'm guessing starter deck that's my guess okay it looks like it is oh gosh what could this be oh my gosh no dude what is wrong with you what is wrong with you? Oh my goodness. I, like, it's in terrible condition, obviously, but it is sealed. 
a sealed starter deck Kaiba. Check that out and check that out. Thank you for shopping at Toys R Us. That is incredible. Okay, now I'm feeling like I should have sent him more stuff after this. Because <laughs> these are like really, really awesome items. Wow. That is so cool. Dude, thank you. That's really cool. I knew it was a starter deck, but I was not expecting it to be. I was like, okay, look, if it's a starter deck, surely it's not like a 2002 one. This is insane, dude. Like, this is like really awesome. Okay, so we have two more mystery items. Then we're probably going to open up like something. We'll probably open like the Legendary Collection GX or the, the tin because we're not opening that. We're keeping that sealed, even though it is, you know, in bad shape. That is going to go in the sealed collection. That's pretty awesome. Okay. What? Oh, ho, ho. No! A tin, dude! This card is so cool. I pulled this in my every pack opening when I opened every single pack. I never even real I didn't even realize this card was in World Superstars. I was like, this is like a really like this is such a cool card. I didn't I I always thought that that set was really bad. And then I saw this card when I pulled it and I was like, wait a second. This set actually has two really cool cards. This one and the Dark Magician version. I think it's called like legendary or dark magician of i'll pop it up on the screen whatever it's called i can't remember but wow oh my goodness dude okay this is this slid up is that what has happened here wait a second okay there we go we slid it down a little bit oh my goodness this is insane like these aren't crazy valuable Bruh. but they, i mean they still have good value i mean they're like blue eyes but they're such cool cards oh my gosh this is awesome this is gonna be this is gonna be a fun video, especially when we open this stuff. Okay, how can we put this all in here? Okay, we have one more mystery item, one more slab. <laughs> I don't even know. Okay, that's the back. I don't even know how we can top this stuff. We <laughs> he gave us a blue eyes deck, a blue eyes ultimate dragon tin, and a legendary dragon of white tin. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm going to have to send a mystery package round two. I mean, I sent some cool stuff, but I don't know if it can compare to this. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's see what the last thing is. <gasps> no! Is that... That's a wavy Raigeki? That is so cool. Near Mint 7. So, like, if this was, like, a 10, it would be, like, worth, like, $2,000. So, even a 7 is, like, crazy. I mean, check that wavy. I don't have a wavy copy of this, actually. Do I even have a... No, I do have a glossy one that I just submitted. This is actually really cool. I love I love Raigeki. It's one of my favorite cards, especially the wavy version. That is really awesome. Wow. Okay. This is already a 10-minute video. Do we even need to open anything? I guess we should open something. How about, um, how about we do the Legendary Collection and see what we get? And uh, we'll save the Rarity Collection, the Blue Eyes, all that stuff for later. Yeah, talk about some epic items. Okay. Christmas came early. Technically, yes. <laughs> Christmas did come early. All right. By the way, I got this idea. It wasn't even for me or Rhyme Style. I was buying something that I sent to Rhyme Style. I actually got from John at House of Champs. And he was he was telling me he got them. And he was like, hey, you want some of these? And I was like, I mean, maybe, you know, I don't really know if I do. Like, um, And he was like, dude, this would be like a really good item for you to buy and then do some sort of swap with like rhyme style or something or because I think he would like it or something like that. And I was like, that's actually a great idea. So I was like, yep, give me give me some of those. So you guys will see that when he opens it up and uh, you guys will see probably what it is. He, I don't know if it, you won't know exactly, but I can't reveal it yet because he's probably gonna watch this video and I don't wanna spoil what's in his package. It's some pretty cool stuff. So yeah, I wanted to give John some props there. So thank you, HOC for that. Let's go ahead and open these mega packs right here. We also have the promos, Raviel. There's like literally 14 promos, I think. It's crazy. It's huge. It's way too many. So let's go ahead and open these up and then we can finish off this video. But pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. I'm definitely happy with this. Definitely a cool swap. Here we go. Let's see if we can pull a Cyber Dragon Secret Rare alternate art. Let's see if we can do that. Destiny and Dragoon. Oh! Did I say Cyber Dragon or Cyber Ring Dragon? I think I said Cyber Dragon, which is what I meant. But well, we got a Cyber End Dragon alternate art secret rare. So that's almost as good as what we wanted. Actually, technically probably better. That looks amazing. Yet another awesome thing Rhyme Style sent us. Dimensional Prison is actually a good card. And Elements... I mean, these are just such cool packs. Percentage Tricks and Wild Edge. I remember when these were back in stores for 
It was like, was that two years ago now? Whew, time's flying. I cannot wait till they reprint Yugi, Yugi's World because I'm going to buy a lot of that. I love that set. It's such a good set. So I think they should do that soon because they've done one and they've done um, Legendary Collection 2. So they should move on to that one next. Edge Hammer. Here we go. Malicious. That's a pretty good card. They've reprinted it a lot, but pretty cool. Ooh, Mermillo. That's a nice one. Rainbow Dragon. Cool. Feather Shot. There's just so many good cards you can pull here. All right, three more packs. Let's see what we can get. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to open that rarity collection. We're going to have to do that soon, I think. That is going to be pretty awesome. The Six Samurai Yaichi. Here we go. Clay Charge. Des Destiny Hero Dreadmaster. I was always trying to pull this. Oh, calm down there, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. I was always trying to pull this out of Enemy of Justice uh, Ultimate Rare. We never got it, so that was kind of sad. Oh, Elemental Hero, Flame Wing Man, Secret Rare. And a Magical Mallet Rare. That's cool. Or, uh, Ultra Rare. Sorry, not Rare. That was a good pack. Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. Here we go. Let's get this back. Let's sleeve this bad boy up. Secret Rare. These are actually pretty valuable, even in Unlimited. First Edition, this set is actually very valuable. All right. Mega Pack. Legendary Collection 2. Whew. What can we pull? Can we pull the Cyber Dragon to top it all off? Or the Shining Phoenix Enforcer? Or the... Uh, sorry. The Shining Flare Wingman. Shining Phoenix Enforcer would also be cool, but we know we don't pull that. Oh, this was in uh, Light of Destruction, I think. We just pulled it the other day. Hero Counter Attack. Inishi Shin's Chancellor. We just pulled this in Ultimate Rare in the Glass video. Make sure you check that one out. Ooh, Gladiator Beats Darius. Cool. Cyber Dragon, the regular art. Cool. So we didn't get the Cyber Dragon. We didn't get the secret alt art version, but we got the Ultra. That's cool. Gladiator Beats Darius. I actually really like this art a lot better. It's just very nostalgic. It looks really cool. From the tin, especially. I had two of those back in the day. Final pack of this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed this mystery box opening. It's pretty crazy. Make sure you'll get to watch another one. Rhyme Style opens his up. Should be maybe like the day after Christmas, the day after that, something like that. Zanji. Crystal Beast. Sapphire Pegasus. Cyber Twin. Oh my goodness. We got all the Cybers. And Cyber Phoenix. Wow. That's crazy. We got all kinds of Cybers. So we got the Secret Rare Cyber Twin Dragon. That is really cool. So out of that, we got Flame Wingman, and then we got Cyber Dragon, Cyber Twin Dragon, and Cyber End Dragon, all in the same box. That's the Cyber Dragon box. That was really awesome. So once again, we pulled some really crazy stuff out of that mystery box. I mean, not really pulled. It was like sent to us. But that was a lot of fun. So thank you again, Rhyme Style. I hope you enjoy your box when you open it up. And make sure you guys check that video out. It's going to be pretty fun. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright, Boom! Oh, <laughs>